it is a genre that I absolutely love. I love watching westerns. Yeah. And I love being in a western. Actor Walton Goggins recently treated in his beloved vintage scene Los Angeles for a sprawling property in New York when he moved to the East Coast in 2022. Property records show that Walton's current house, located in Hudson Valley, New York, was purchased in December 2020 for $1.6 million, a remarkable deal considering its features. This residence was once a hunting lodge and boasts a rich history of hosting renowned figures such as Walt Disney and Babe Ruth, originally belonging to George LaBranche. The wood and stone property was built in 1928. Inside, the mansion offers nine bedrooms, 10 bathrooms, and a total of 8,000 square feet. Walton sold his former home, situated atop Hollywood Boulevard, for over $3.6 million, and the English country-style residence only took two weeks to close the deal. While living here, Walton fully restored the estate, adding modern elements like a sleek marble kitchen alongside timeless features like arch doorways, vintage chandeliers, and more. The entryway marked by a striking wooden door leads into the 3,240 square foot layout brimming with the allure of old Hollywood. The home offered highlights like a grand living room with beam ceilings, cozy breakfast nook, grounds with gardens, a swimming pool, charming outdoor dining spot, and much more. Wallen Goggins is a versatile American actor known for his captivating performances on film and TV. Born in 1971 in Birmingham, Alabama, Goggins developed a passion for acting at a young age. His career has been marked by a remarkable range, portraying characters spanning from intense villains to charming, affable personalities. Goggins rose to prominence with his role as Detective Shane Vendrell in the critically acclaimed TV series The Shield. He further solidified his reputation with standout performances in shows like Justified and Vice Principals. Walton earned praise for his ability to give each character unique quirks and complexities. In addition to his TV work, Goggins has made a significant impact in film, appearing in a diverse range of projects, including roles in The Hateful Eight, Django Unchained, Ant-Man and the Wasp, and much more. Most recently, we can see him starring in the Prime Video series Fallout. Beyond his professional accomplishments, Goggins is known for his dedication to his family life. He's married to filmmaker and writer Nadia Connors, and the two share a son, Augustus, together. Goggins' home life reflects his southern roots and his appreciation for simplicity and authenticity. While he has experienced success in the entertainment industry, while he experienced success in the entertainment industry, he maintains a down-to-earth demeanor and values the importance of staying connected to his roots. Walton lived for years in a stunning LA home, but in the last few years, he and his family decided to pack up and move to the East Coast. In 2022, Walton Goggins decided to trade in his residence in Los Angeles for a breathtaking estate located in the scenic Hudson Valley, New York. Public records show that this remarkable property was purchased for December 2020 for $1.6 million, which was a huge deal considering its size, beauty, and historical significance. Formerly a hunting lodge with a rich history of hosting notable figures like Walt Disney and Babe Ruth, this property dates back to 1928, and it was originally owned by George LaBranche. With its picturesque setting, the estate offers a total of 9 bedrooms, 10 bathrooms, a grand living space, and 8,000 square feet throughout. Retaining much of its historic charm, the interior of Walton's home boasts rustic paneled walls, wooden floors, and beam ceilings. In the spacious living room, there is a grand stone fireplace adding warmth and character to the space. The kitchen's equipped with light brown cabinets, a farmhouse sink, and modern appliances. But there's also plenty of room for customization and adding the family's personal style. The formal dining room offers a wood-burning fireplace and ample natural light streaming in through the expansive windows. But again, it also has the potential to be redecorated to suit one's taste. A highlight of the estate is the sunroom, adorned with a glamorous chandelier, 
and offering panoramic views of the lush grounds. The expansive master suite has antique wall sconces and the space provides a serene retreat with room for a sitting area and an ensuite bathroom. Situated on an impressive 122 acres of land, Walton's New York estate includes two ponds and picturesque views of the surrounding hills. Additionally, a spacious greenhouse on the property is a haven for gardening enthusiasts. While Walton and his family moved to their Hudson Valley home recently, they adored the LA pad they lived in prior to that, and much like their current home, it was also full of character. During his time here, Walton completely restored and redesigned the home, filling it with keepsakes from his travels, as well as comfy gathering spaces, both indoors and out. When Walton was still living here, he explained about the design of his home. My philosophy is a person shouldn't have to take more than six or eight steps without having an opportunity to sit down for a conversation to begin. It didn't take much for Walton to offload his nearly century-old residence for $3.665 million in 2022, not to mention it surpassed his initial asking price by a noteworthy 315 k It took the actor a mere two weeks to secure a buyer for the home, which he originally acquired for $1.55 million back in 2010. Originally conceived and constructed by Harold O. Sexsmith in 1927, this estate has changed ownership only three times over the course of its impressive 94-year history. Concealed behind a gated entrance providing privacy and security, this property basks in sunlight throughout the day, while gardens surrounding the home boast fruit trees. Every aspect of this unique home, from the coffered front door to the hardwood floors, the arched openings to the casement windows, have been meticulously restored, preserving the original charm, warmth, and ambiance of the 1920s. While living here, Goggins diligently restored the estate, introducing modern touches like a sleek marble kitchen, while making sure to preserve its timeless charm with features like tile floors, arched doorways, vintage chandeliers, and more. The home boasts four bedrooms, three baths, and 3,144 square feet of space throughout. Upon entering the home, guests are greeted by a foyer decked out with original period tile floors. To the left, there's a formal living room with plenty of windows and a grand stone wood burning fireplace. The nearby living room seamlessly transitions into indoor outdoor lounges connected by French doors, providing intimate spaces for gatherings. Wong's former home was full of details that embodied the air of the property, like Juliet balconies and period flooring. The main floor also offers the Eden kitchen, which the actor redid while living here, as well as a large pantry with laundry facilities and guest bedroom with ensuite. Moving upstairs, a stylish master suite boasts an equally stylish bathroom and a generous walk-in closet. Two additional guest bedrooms, a bathroom, an office, and a Juliet balcony overlooking the front garden complete the upper level. Additional amenities of the home include a basement and a two-car garage. This property was full of the spirit of the iconic Chateau Marmont and the style of the Roaring Twenties, making it a unique purchase for the right buyer. Moving outdoors, the serene backyard offers two outdoor dining areas, a fire pit lounge, and a pool that seamlessly blends in with its surroundings, framed by citrus trees and fairy light. As we can see from this tour, Walton Goggins' homes show his creative spirit and passion. The blend of history, style, and warmth that his properties are full of paints a picture of the actor's taste. Through his commitment to maintaining a strong connection to his roots and prioritizing a rich home life with his loved ones, like his wife and son, Walton shows the importance of finding balance and fulfillment in both personal and professional spheres. While that wraps up today's video, answer this question for me before you go. If you are an actor or celebrity, what reasons may cause you to move away from Hollywood? Let me know down in the comments. Don't forget to hit subscribe and turn on your notifications so you never miss a video. I'm Kara, follow me on Instagram to chat and I'll see you all next time. Bye. Hey everyone, it's Kara or Kara the Vampire Slayer as you might know me and given my love for all things house and home, I recently wanted to get more hands on myself and I started tackling DIY projects at my own house. Being a new homeowner, there are plenty of unexpected things to fix and it's cool to learn what you're doing and hopefully be able to fix it yourself. 
There are also plenty of DIY projects suitable for beginners like me to do and ones that improve the look of your space drastically. Follow me and I'll teach you what I'm learning and motivate you to join me. You can DIY on a budget even if you're a total beginner. Follow me on Fix It with Kara and we can chat.